Hey guys, freaking awesome, back in action with Minecraft Xbox One Edition. Yes, that's right, we are back, but this time, if you noticed, I am in a different world. That is because this is a different world I've been working on other than the other to the survival and my underwater world. After I last... After I left you guys last time on the last video, I had to, um, I finished all the glass for the underwater dome and everything. I had to use glass blocks because I found out glass panes wouldn't work. So, did all that. Did a little bit of adjusting on the, um, tower, or, did I build that after... No, you guys were there. I changed the little top bit that was over the water. Did that. Um, I've got some more plan to do that s s before I can continue. So I honestly wanted to bring you guys some content, and I didn't feel like playing some Warframe right now, which you guys are absolutely eating up. By the way, thank you for that. But um, I just need to continue something or create something new because when I have an idea in my mind it honestly doesn't stay very long so I usually have to get it down quick and that's what we're going to be doing today um let me show you around the place real quick this is my place I just decided to hop on here quick and Er, this is my original world. This is the first world I created on the Xbox One. Did this to get back into the swings of it. See also um what they all had in the Xbox One edition all together. Cause um whew, sorry about that. It's really early. Because um I know they're missing a lot of stuff. They're missing the horses and the hay bales and all that stuff. But they have the carpet. So, that kind of makes up for it. So, I got the house. I got my well next to it. I got my little potato farm. I don't know why I decided potatoes. I just thought I want something where I don't have to make it into bread or anything. And I can also get something else other than potatoes. I can get um, poisonous potatoes from it too when that happens. But, yeah, I got my nice little stone walkway. Got my house. Got my little fishing hut with my prized fish there. Got my fishing pole. Whoop. Got a chest with some raw fish for bait. A fishing rod and a boat. Nice little... Um, whoop. A nice little dock. Oh, sorry guys, it really is early. Um, let's go into the house. I didn't, I used gray wool for, like, welcome mats, so. There, wipe my feet before I come in. Yeah, I got the kitchen here. I got nice two st ovens. I got a cauldron with some water in it for the sink. I got a countertop. And a Bruin stand. Also, if you guys haven't noticed, this is the um, pack. It is a re really nice texture pack. It looks really nice. I love it. Thinking of getting the Skyrim pack or whatever it is. Because that looks... I know what the textures are in Skyrim. I've played a little bit of it. I haven't actually full on play the game but it is pretty fun so it would be kind of nice if they also did um a fallout one that would look awesome oh could you imagine the zombies that would be sweet but yeah here's my fridge got some nice red carpet um my little crafting area with all my stuff I want want to take that out I don't know um got my little Oh, I forgot to take out the um 
stupid stuff that's all about um the tips hold on I think I'll do that um sends options hints in game tooltips that's it all right but yeah I got my little enchanting area here then we got the upstairs we got the bed we got a nice little rug in front of it we got some books we got books nice little deck porch or whatever you want to call it also love what I did with the back I really like that I honestly was thinking of just doing all glass or just doing this just uh, like this kind of what I was doing before but I just had it against it because I had to do stairs to get up one more every time and I noticed how nice that looked so I just went with that it was really nice I actually had like another little project going right over here this huge area that was a gigantic barn but that just looked ugly and all that so and I got my little well here pretty simple well but I actually didn't make it that deep but you can't really tell from the actual top so it works sorry it really is early yeah but it works out well really nice but anyways let me show you where we are going to build alright now if only I can remember I kinda get lost over here cuz I didn't make those big enough that I would notice them from too far away um that ah, there it is it took me a while to clear this out but I think it is well worth it as when we're when we were done when we are done it is gonna look nice it is gonna span from all the way from this little rock cliff to into this whole one right here well, let me just get up and show you how big that is yeah I also gotta admit the world height for this is huge oh my god I don't even think I could stop I just went straight up just so I could get a look at everything it is huge it's 36 times bigger oh, again sorry sorry the world is 30 times 6 bigger it is great oh my god but yeah, it's gonna span all the way from here into there. I'm gonna make it like a. I'm probably gonna make like a little segway looking type thing or something, maybe like a little tram. But, anyways, let's get into it. Um. Alright, clear the inventory so we can get into it. First off we are going to have hmm I actually gotta think about this because I haven't used as many of the things as what I've pretty much just used wood for almost everything I've built in here so far other than a few stone and the bricks and everything <sighs> oh, it really is early god I don't even think I should be playing this this early All right. Hmm. End stone. That's new. Oh, it's already starting to get night. Well, let's just get the stuff that we are going to use. We are going to use the quartz. A lot of quartz. We are also going to be using. The end stone, whatever that is. Honestly, I've never been to the end or anything. Um, 
quartz stairs, quartz slabs we are going to need. Um. Hmm. Also going to grab the... Di Ugh. God. Also going to grab the block of gold, iron, and emerald for now. Oop. To, um, actually use, maybe use those, I don't know, hopefully we will, because I honestly want some color in what I make. Yeah, this is what I mean, I can't find it. That's too much woodland over, there it is. When I see this, I gotta go right. I gotta remember that. I keep forgetting that. The only real thing I got to distinguish my building is the light. And that's pretty much it. That and it's built in an open area. There's so many small, like, lava pits everywhere. It is just crazy. Where am I going? Also, if endstone, honestly, I've really never been to the nether. I've never, not the nether, the end. So I really don't know what the endstone does. But if it spawns, um, endermen, don't worry. I've got the, um, you get out of here, chicken. Whoop, ah, great. I've got it on peaceful, because... I don't care about. Nope, wrong thing. Ah, there we go. I don't care. There we go. I don't care for having to deal with monsters and that, or villagers or anything else. Ooh, I would make for a nice marble floor. Um. Ooh. I should have used this for a countertop. That looks nice. But I got to admit. These are very similar. Similar. This one's wider. This one's more of a. This one's more of a chalk color. This one's more of a ivory. I guess you would say. But I think I know what we are going to use. Yeah, this is nice. I just kind of wish that this actually connected together a bit better. Hold on, dude. We got... Uh, no. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> well, anyways, let's see. What side are we going to have this be the front of? I think this would be perfect right here. This kind of arched shape. Have this be the front and the back. There would be a little tram system or something that runs over to that one. Of which I'll flatten out or something. I don't know. I want to try and keep the natural beauty of it. Unlike this one where I pretty much just leveled the whole thing and brought one or two blocks that were below the level I wanted up. So, I'm gonna... I'll think about it, but let's just get this done first. I wanna get the front building done. Alright. We got a perfect little area for our doors. That is nice. And if you're asking how is this gonna work for doors, I'll explain in a little bit. I'll explain later. Whoop! Dee! 